Hello folks, this is going Spy, the spy will come to life for the next announcement, um, yeah, um, the details of what I put in of the information of how the mission of the story canon of the Incredible Hulk has gone, has already been dialed and from what I can gather so far, but like I said, we, I might be able to discover some new things as we proceed down and word into the process of the Incredible Hulk further into the story. Now, um... I'm also going to be, uh, now would be uh, telling you about the two weeks that I've been gone. After, um, that, I was able to complete this series of the Command Conquer 3 Tiberian Wars the Scram campaign, finally. Um. I went on a little bit of vacation, a trip with my father to the mountains, uh, where it's called, a small town called Gallenberg, where we then uh, bought ourselves a cabin uh, to be able to spend good quality time there. And, well, I didn't... We didn't exactly do much up in the mountains, considering the fact we hardly have any place left to go to anyway. So, um... Uh, during the process in the mountains, however, I took it, the opportunity to be able to go onto my computer to be able to customize on and to edit some of the videos to, um improve chances for people to notice so yeah it's one uh, good thing I was able to take a note about doing in the mountains uh. and then after a while we've uh, had a good quality time uh, just looking around the place of Gallenberg and the town we've um Taken pride of notice of one of, of seeing the cars that used to be in, in the movies of Fast and Furious. Yeah. So, um, among those cars, and there are some other cars uh, from other movies like Batman, like from the Avengers, and from. The, um, um, the Transylvania show, and, and then probably some stuff uh, about, um, shit, um, yeah. There, there's a bunch of cool cars there we were able to check out to see. But other than that, we've um, done some shopping for groceries uh, for the cabinet for us to be able to cook supper. And like I said, we haven't done much in Gallenberg, considering that there's not much special going on. I, I suppose we could have been able to do something like run some roll coasters and such, but um, couldn't be able to do it at the time. And then, and then after a while, I was um. Uh, we'd gone back from Gallenberg. Father was able to drop me off at my mother's place. And 
during the process, I spent the two weeks uh, with on in Marival with my mother. She was able to teach me how to be able to drive a car and how to be able to stay safe in the road and to look out for incoming cars, the signs, and such. And also be able to how to be able to work with a vehicle like moms. And for a while, for a couple of times, we've actually made good progress. So that's uh, kind of now the reason why. Now it's not the reason why I've spent the two weeks um, in Maryville, uh to be able to. To stay in the house with my mother is because the, um, because I've been working my driver's license, and when I so right now when I'm confident that I'll be able to learn how to do be safe in the road to be able to learn how to drive my own, and to be able to be successful in the driving's test. Then, and only then, I'll be able to be ready to learn and how to drive safely on the road and to be able to know about how to read directions on signs on the road. So, yeah, so the arrangement deal between me and her is that the two weeks that I spend with her will be for a driver's license test. And then when I get back from my from that place, back to here, where my father's place is at, I'll be able to work on the stuff on YouTube and to be able to complete the series of the games that I want to be able to get things done about, and then so on and then so forth. So yeah, that's the arrangement the deal that that me and mom came to an agreement about. And so did father. He was okay with it. Reluctant, yes, but okay with it. He wants me to do my personal best with the driver's license test. It's not just him, the rest of my family too. It's been a really long time, struggling process for me to uh, be able to spare any free hands time. To be able to spare any time to driver's license test and to learn how to drive and to be able to read the instruction manual book on the pages about signs of directions. But it's going to be worth it in the long run. <sighs> yeah. Good shit here. Really helps me to concentrate and to be able to think straight and to be able to again to be able to focus to talk about the stuff of the topic sense. So, uh, while I be uh, doing stuff on YouTube, I'll be doing some driver's license stuff with my mother on the two weeks, uh, and on every two weeks. So, the arrangement deal is this. I spend two weeks with her just to learn driver's license test, and I spend the two weeks to be able to do this. That's the arrangement deal. She... Uh, 
came up with, but I was, I agree with her because <sighs> originally I didn't really want to be able to drive before, but nowadays I just want it over with because people on my branch side of the family, my mother, my father, my grandmother, and amongst some other people has been hounding me for wanting to be able to get a driver's license, been wanting me to get this done because they think I've been procrastinating things, which I'm really, really not procrastinating on things or delaying shit or any kind. It's been a really, really trying, hard process, time I'm coping to deal with. So, it's been really hard for me to be able to put my full focus effort into driver's license. Because even if I do somehow manage to be able to get a driver's license, uh, I still need a car. Which my father and my mother are going to be taking liberty to look that up for me. And I've already given them explained of details of what kind of car I want. A car that's red. Yes, color of red. I said it. Deal with it. Color of red. And, and then in the middle, and inside the car, there's the screen. Will you be able to see what's behind your car? So you'd be able to look on the screen to see if there's any people, pedestrians, or cars coming in. Then, then just you had to look over your shoulder on on the right end. And. And a, um, it's got to be like a, a car that is able to handle a four person in, in it, yeah. So yeah, I've already told them the specifics of the with car I've wanted, and that's the specifics. So, once I get my driver's license, uh, which will be a long time process, but it will be done before Christmas, hopefully. So, I'll be able to, um, to finally be able to have this done, because once that I be able to finally get a car, driver's license, then the real work begins because I'll need to be able to learn how to do travel, so drive in myself, making sure I'd be able to make sure there's gas in the car and not be able to blow stuff up. Yeah. Otherwise, you'd be able to get stuck in the middle of nowhere. You need to be forced to uh, call someone to get you or call someone to fix your car up. Which, my uh, mother is already hounding me on the point of wanting to make sure that I make sure I put gas in my car. Yeah. Uh, she's quite of a drill sergeant. On uh, that's uh, too much for my taste. Like, I, I can deal with the fact of instructions, orders from teachers, but I cannot handle a drill sergeant instructions because it's been drilling in my head, reminding me what mistakes that I've made, hounding me on the fact of what I should or shouldn't do. It's really, really not a picnic, trust me. But I had to be able to endure it because you be able to because you be able to make sure you're not cracked under pressure. Which in this case the pressure will be from my muffer. Yeah. 
so that's pretty much it for this video folks I'll be able to get started with the Incredible Hulk this afternoon tonight. This has gone spy, the spy sign off.